Henry, sa Henry says, what is your pros and cons of public affairs compared to combat camera? We won't even get into that loaded question at the moment, but I will tell you that typically public affairs, uh, their footage, their photos and video gets released and typically combat cameras footage and photos get held for internal review. So that's all I'll say about that. There you go. I mean, actually, um, I mean, that's the yeah, typical I'll say, fleet. I'll say the same thing. Mainly because none of my stuff got famous until I worked with public affairs on the news. There you go. <laughs> it's true. So, uh, let's see. Uh, Raphael, what is the difference between the branches and which is the best? A loaded question. We'll answer that some other time, but I appreciate the question. Finry says, have you been shot? Big exclamation point questions. Uh, answer. No. Answer. Yes. Daily block. <laughs> He's blocked. No. Have you been shot? No, I haven't fucking shot. <laughs> <laughs> is there a single MOS for mechanics? There's a bunch of mechanic MOSs oh, out there. Aviation, Avi motor T, a whole Yeah, aviation, motor T. There, there's, there's a bunch of different ones if you want to get into that. Kiwi says, why did you hit, get hate getting stationed in Japan? Hate? Um, well, I mean, you're far away from family. Time zones are different. So, like, if, if I wanted to even talk to them, like, they're going to bed as I'm waking up. So that, that time difference is hard. And also just like complete transition. Like I went from high school to living in Okinawa, like across the world. It's kind of tough, you know? But Isaac, you enjoyed Okinawa, right? You I, still enjoy Okinawa, right? Yeah, and I extended for another year because I liked it so much. So Isaac loves it. Gus doesn't like it. So it depends who you are and I, what I your mean, priorities are. because I hate my current job. But <laughs> because I hate my life now? We won't go into that can of worms. Fruit Loop said if the Coast Guard offered you a $5,000 signing bonus, would you have signed? Probably not. For me, because I joined to be a Marine, but that was that. Yeah, me too. I didn't join for money. I wanted to be a Marine. <clears throat> Trent said, how did the Marine Corps gain the title Devil Dogs? <laughs> history lesson. Uh, uh, history. Let okay. Uh, okay. Uh, we got your question. Go. Your boy go. Gus got you. <laughs> freestyle it. <laughs> hey, hey, right. it <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could freestyle this answer for you, but uh, back in 1918, if that's the correct... Yeah, 1918, the Battle of Bella Wood... Uh, the Germans nicknamed us Teufelhunden, which means devil dog in German, even though there's a lot of like information on whether that even happened yeah. because of the Marines, fight, like they named us Teufelhunden because of the, our fighting ferocity, blah, blah, blah. But there's even uh, like information like they never did that. Like that was U.S. propaganda that took the German word and made it like that after the battle. So that's a uh, little history lesson for you. A little bit of a myth. Passing it back over to Clayton. Oh crap! There's a guy right there. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. oh he, he's trying to drop shot me. Oh, I'm letting him go. <laughs> yeah, I can't see him. Hey Gus, have you been deployed as combat camera again? Um, I haven't been de deployed to Afghanistan. Uh, I've deployed on a muse. So I lived on ship for like six months at a time. For I did that for like a year. And that was a lot of fun. I worked with a bunch of different units. Worked with recon. Recon's really cool. I know you guys like to hear about recon. Um, fast roping out of helicopters onto boats, doing cool stuff like that, shooting machine guns, all the good stuff. It was a lot of fun. Yeah, I'm, I'm in the, I'm in the hey, zone, bro. You're getting it, you're getting it. Yeah. There you go. Hey, uh, Garrett said the game is laggy. It might be your internet connection. We're, we're all good on this end right now. Maybe try refreshing. What is your favorite part of boot camp? Uh, graduating. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Parker, or who wants me to do, let's see, Swag Daddy wants me to do my daily blog again. Maybe a weekly blog, but maybe not daily again. That's, it takes a lot of work that, a lot of work. Um, there is a minimum height for Motor T, Ivan, but you can just consult Google. I don't know it offhand. There, though, for every job, there's a minimum height. Just to be a Marine, there's a minimum height, but. Uh, Gamster, that sounds all right, man. We won't be able to add you to the party, but you can come into the game. Um... <clears throat> I agree. I, I personally, I mean, I don't have any operational experience with it, obviously, for combat deployment, but I agree with the M4 replacing the M16. M16's yeah, been... Piece of gear. Yeah, it's like smaller. It does the same thing. And, like, the M16's been in service for, like, 50 years, bro. Like, since, what, Vietnam? Like, it's yeah. time. It's time to move on. Uh, I remember, like, being a kid and getting ready to, like, join the military. I remember being young and wanting to join the military and like looking at like future weapons on the military channel. But like, wow, I'm gonna have like a laser gun <laughs> yeah, when I join. Yeah. And now I use like the same thing my dad used. And yeah. like, <laughs> it's ridiculous. So I think the M4 is a good upgrade. Um, what is the hardest part about transitioning to civilian life? 
after the military and how did that help you after your time in the Marine Corps? So for me, transitioning out of the Marine Corps was actually extremely stressful. Uh, it took a toll on me physically and mentally. Like, uh, and I had, I had a good plan set up too. I even had job offers lined up and at one point I didn't get hired for the job I wanted, which I have now, but, if, but initially I didn't get hired. And I was like, how am I going to pay my bills? How am I going to pay for my house, my car? And it's scary, but um, you pull through and things always work out. And worst case scenario, they pay you to go to call. <clears throat> they said, 1v1 me, scrub. But so it's like, man. Uh, let's see. I don't know about your par your question there, Parker. Let's see. Taxes. Yeah. What was I about? Subscribe to the channel. Also, stream to help with better mic equipment or donate games or anything like that. My P.O. box is listed in the video description below. Trent says, people always say that I am stupid for choosing to enlist the Marines instead of going to college first. Obviously, I don't agree with them. Uh, DMK says, I'm a corpsman, so we can do this Navy versus Marine 1v1. Maybe later, but I'm open to that. <coughs> Let's see. So many questions going on. I don't like country. No. Shredded Stewie. Yes, we all got the MOSs we wanted. Let's see. You would Fruit Loops. You would think that college before the Marine Corps would make you would be an officer, but I know a lot of dudes that went through college and then went enlisted, which is I don't recommend, but I know a lot of people that have done that. <clears throat> Raphael says he'll donate me a drill instructor. All right. Do I still use my dress blues? No. Only at the Marine Corps ball, which I didn't this past year. I wore a suit because... Uh, did you wear your medals on? Do you rate that? I, I do rate the medals. I rate, yeah, I rate five medals, yeah. <laughs> hey, I enlisted in the Marines and I got communications job. What is your viewpoint on communications? My ship date is August 22nd. Communications, comms dudes tend to, I mean, I, my experience, I know some cool comms dudes, but they like oh, they hate do. their lives. <laughs> they do. For sure I hate their lives. <laughs> I'm not going to speak because I don't want to like, oh, what's, <laughs> well, uh, the general consensus, uh, consensus seems to be that the Marine Corps is what you make it, but I know a lot of dudes that hate their job as comms, but you'll be all right. Keep I mean, in there, buddy. Actually, I know a guy, he went in as comm, and then. All right, so one of my buddies, he went in as comm. And then after, like, he got to his unit and someone was like, hey, who needs, who wants to go to the Force Recon Platoon? Oh. And he raised his hand, did, like, a physical fitness test, and then he was part of the Force Recon Platoon, which is, like, the high speed of the high speed. That's cool. They can and, also attach to, like, cool yeah, units. Yeah, they can attach to cool units. So, I mean, it, it is what you make it. And then, I mean, sometimes you got to get lucky. Yeah. There you go. Do you guys have experience with SIGINT guys? Like, the difference between going rad battalion, support, or recon. I guess you're talking radio. Is that what you're trying to talk about right now? For me? <clears throat> I'm this comment here. He's using a bunch of uh, acronyms. Oh, man, I have no acronyms. Either. Yeah, I don't know, man. You have to break, break down the acronyms real quick. <laughs> they, aren't, they aren't the same across the military. Zane says, thank you for protecting our country. Thank you for visiting the stream. That's my response. What do you say when somebody says thank you for? Oh, it's always so weird for me. <clears throat> I remember, like, I remember I saying like thank you love. back. Like yeah, I say. Yeah. <laughs> Someone's like thank you for your service. Like thank you. Like thank you for um, me. I guess. Yeah. Like, you're, I don't want to say you're welcome. That's way too pretentious in my opinion. I had this I one instructor tell me like if you don't know what to say, you just say it's an honor serving. You know? There you yeah, go. That's pretty good. That's yeah, good. it's pretty good. It's an honor serving. <laughs> it's an honor serving. Oh man. Let's see. Well, I gotta head out. All right, let's see. I'm, I'm trying to keep up with all the comments here. Um, except now. Oh wait. Yeah, here. Hey, Troy. Hey, What's up? There is an on the oh, there. Oh, oh yeah. Who's Is it from? It? I have no clue. Here, try accepting it. It might be from Bacon. Oh, yeah, you can. Yeah, you can leave it. Oh, Gamster. All right, we're with Gamster. Real quick, if you hit this button right here, we yeah, should be owned by Kraz. There we go. Oh, wait, I heard the wrong guy. Wait, wait, wait. This looks weird. I'm like on your lap. <laughs> All right, we're good now. Oh, I didn't mean to leave the party though. There we go. All right, we're in business now. 
radio battalion support, like NSA, three-letter agency, or... Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I don't have too much experience in the way of the radio battalion stuff. Comms guys, I guess, would fall into that. I don't know. I can't answer that question. I'm sorry. I wish I could help you. <clears throat> when people th- when people thank you, just nod your head, says for Loops. Okay. <laughs> Sounds almost pretentious. Like, thank you. Like, goddamn right. <laughs> you throw up throw the blood inside. Yeah. Yeah. Saw, dude. Saw, dude. <laughs> Clay, what state are you in now? I would like to hunt you down and kill you. Just kidding, that's not what the comment says, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> we're in Maryland. <laughs> we're in Maryland. Yeah, uh, You're in ROTC and people say thank you for your service. Just be like, I haven't served yet, but I appreciate the compliment. So that's what I recommend you saying. Because you didn't serve yet. Oh, man. Garrett says reinvite him. Oh, there he is, it's right there. How to live stream. Shadow, are you asking how do we live stream? How hard is it to get into the Marines and why try to get, and because you want to get in? Not hard at all. Go see your recruiter. Should you invest in the Elgato capture card? Elgato? Yeah, I have an Elgato. Of you should, right? It's worth it. <laughs> of course you could, because I'm sponsored by Elgato. Elgato <laughs> capture card, the best and most high performance capture card in all the world. No, I think it's great. I've liked it. I've had it for a couple of weeks. I enjoy it. I'm not sponsored by Elgato. <sighs> Swift, yes. Shredded, hard to get armorer, no. Austin, don't post ship dates. You'll be fine. No one's going to hunt you down. Doubtful. Uh, let's see. I think you're all right posting your ship date. Are civilian or other people allowed to come into your barracks? Not there. You can, you can sign them in, but technically they're not allowed to stay there. Technically. <clears throat> wow. How do I bang Wooks? That is a guaranteed way to get you blocked from the stream. <laughs> Jeez. Savage. Oh, man. The fact that Savage. That, like, Dude, but here's the thing. These dudes are in high school, and they're asking how... Wh- they're saying wooks, pogues, all this stuff. Like, they don't even know what it means. They don't even rate to talk to a Marine, let alone say that stuff. Like, that's what? terrible. <laughs> I know, dude. It's, it's crazy. Awesome. Those, are the type, those are the types that go in and just are, like, complete shit. Hey, like, Devin, what up, bro? Uh... What is the worst part place to be stationed in? I'd say 29 Palms. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. Well, you don't know. I mean, I get a lot of action happens in 29 Palms. True. And 29 okay. If, if you're talking about Pentagon. stuff to do. At, no, I like the Pentagon. I didn't right. hate it. Mm-hmm. It depends. Okay. It depends what you make of it. Mm-hmm. Anywhere you go is can yeah. suck or can be great. But just yeah, I on. I'm going to kick off this game because no one else is joining. Ah, yeah. Kick it off. Oh, wait, wait. Real quick. Gamsa, can you find us a game? Uh, and if you don't find us a game in the next like minute, we'll, we'll back out and find something else. But, uh. But yeah, we'll give him like 10 more seconds. I feel bad if we leave him up the drive. Where were you stationed? I was stationed at DMA uh, in Maryland, and then I was stationed at the Pentagon. Uh, so I like made like a uh, PC, what is it, PCA move to the Pentagon. Okay. And I served the rest there. And I like the Pentagon. I didn't hate the Pentagon. <clears throat> uh, let's see. Courtney says, what do you think about women in the Marine Corps? I think that women belong in the Marine Corps. I think that they're, I know a lot of like hard charging women uh, his girlfriend's in the Marine Corps, so 100%. Marine, if, if you're a woman and you want to join the Marine Corps, do it. The thing that pisses me off more than anything, and I'm going to make a video about this, and I'm probably going to write an article about the same topic, is I get messages sometimes from women that say, I want to join the Marine Corps, but I don't want to get raped. That's a bullshit mentality that you should not have, and that is, it is, it is ridiculous that that's even like a thing that comes to your mind. Like That's not your fault. Like That should be addressed. The Marine Corps, I believe, fosters... Uh, animosity towards women at the basic level at boot camp because you have these drill instructors calling you bitch, girl, all this stuff. And then you have these young kids that are 17, 18 years old and they think that they're... Exactly. They imitate the drill instructors all the way down to their mannerisms and what they say. And for the next two or three years of their enlistment, we wonder why these Marines are treating women like crap. So in my opinion, if you're a woman, join the Marine Corps, be a hard charger, and prove them wrong. Yeah, that's that's the best thing. Prove any any neck... Any negative thing you hear about women in the military, try to prove them wrong. Yeah. That's what you got to do. I concur. Oh, Shadow, I don't know if you can record on Wii U. Brian says, who has the deepest voice? Gus. Hey, Clayton. Okay, let's see. Oh, man. I'm trying to keep up with y'all's comments. I'm, try- I'm trying here. Man, there's a lot of comments, bro. I can't even get through all these. Oh, my God. Oh, no, that's a C4. 
Let's see. Thank you, Garrett. If you guys have any generic questions, please consult Mr. Google. They're helpful. He's helpful. Rogue Kitty says, thank you for your service. Thank you for viewing, and it's a pleasure to serve. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Gustavo, what up? What up? Parker. Shredded Stewie. Hard to go to college while enlisted. I would say um, yes, yeah. Um, because... Yeah, because, I mean, you're bound... That's like... <laughs> it's possible. Or, my yes. doing it. It is possible. So you have to wait until your two-year mark in order to start taking the classes. How and that's what I'm. Luckily, I got grandfathered into uh, not having to wait to the two-year mark. However, like it's so easy by the end of the day, and you're tired, and you're just like, I just want to go play Xbox or go do something with my friends or go to the gym. It it, it takes a lot of work to oh, yeah, to do college. So it's it, t it takes dedication. It's doable, but it takes dedication. <clears throat> Jake says, my friend was super gung-ho and said raw every sentence. He went to 29 Palms and literally lost all motivation. <laughs> that's the most, yeah. that's like the most beautiful haiku. I feel like we should submit <laughs> that somewhere. It's pretty true. My friend used to say raw in every sentence. <laughs> <laughs> then he went to 29 Palms. No motivation. <laughs> yeah. Can you travel out of the country while on leave? I, th I think in like extremely special circumstances, like I know dudes that go to Puerto Rico. In and Okinawa, it's really easy to do. Oh, yeah, in mean, Okinawa like, you, you can. Like when you submit your leave, you have to let them know you're doing that. Yeah, right. as long as you let them know and you have a good plan, you should be all right. Uh, we're going to keep the women in infantry talk. We're going to keep that out of the stream because it's going to take take over and it's a whole other conversation. We'll talk about that later. Shadow says he's been in the Ooh. Air Force. Do the Batman voice. Uh, Where is she? <laughs> you probably heard that. Who are you? <laughs> I'm going to lose my voice. I already lose my voice so easily. Um... You, you kind of have like a perpetual loss of voice sound. I do. It's I've got. Cool though, I like it. Well, people ask like, "Are you it's a smoker?" Unique. And I'm like, "No, I just have a shitty voice." So. <laughs> <laughs> this isn't bad. It's, it's actually it's kind of rugged. I like it. It's got like a rasp to it, but it is what it is. Um, am I a Christian? I suppose you could call me a Christian if you spelled it right. Um, <laughs> oh, snap. Boxy. Oh snap! Oh, <laughs> yeah. hey, that boy needs that Jesus. <laughs> 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 Boxers or briefs? I'm a briefs guy. Would I ever come help a pool EPT if you're from Maryland? Yeah, man, I could even get you some Marine. Or, I mean, I know a lot of the Marine recruiters in Maryland, so I could absolutely show up probably. A lot of my good buddies are recruiters in Maryland. Um, let's see. <laughs> Chris says, Sergeant, how do I get my six-pack PB all past duty? <laughs> Hide it under your shirt. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Do you think that someone who really wants to become a Marine should graduate high school early? Enjoy your high school time. Just oh, yeah. don't graduate early, no. Let's see. How do I move up and rank quickly? Keep your nose clean. Be good physically fit and be good at your job. You'll be fine. Uh, there's a bunch of new stipulations they put in place about time and grade and how long you have to beat each rank. So that sucks for you guys because I didn't have that. <coughs> yep, which really sucks. It's a, it's a year between Lance Corporal and Corporal, and between Corporal and Sergeant, it's another year, which is insane, because it's good, it's necessary, because I was a Lance Corporal, I, I, I was minimum time and grade for each thing, aside from the one meritorious. That's, Ooh. I ranked up way too quick. Yeah, I was about to say, like, you must have been on some serious kill streak. <laughs> I was on some straight up sick kill streak. Yo, you just got stabbed. Dude, Yo, you just got stabbed. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Looks like that guy just killed you. <laughs> Why? Oh, man. Wow, what a question. Let's see. That's how you hide your PBR. There you go, Jake. Right, straight up Austin. That's Is it the army? Says oh, yeah, okay. He's about to tear you up, bro. <laughs> the requirements to rank up between officer and enlisted are significantly different. <laughs> well, you can consult Google for that one. Victor Hernandez from the Mexican Army. I follow your channel since 2015. You do a great job. I would like to talk with you sometime for comparing our armies. Commander Victor Hernandez, that sounds dope, man. Reach out to me, message me, Commander. <laughs> sounds good. Hey Trent, welcome back. Trolls in the stream. Gustavo, while on the base, is your food paid for or do you pay for it yourself? Who wants to answer that question? Um, I have... For food. 
So yeah, there's, there's comrades. And then yeah, you automatically get it through the chow hall. But if you uh, apply for comrades, which is pretty much they give you extra money a month for your own food, and I do that because I like to cook my own chicken and I eat a lot of broccoli. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, right now where I'm at, I don't have access to a jail hall, so I have to buy my own food. Stop, I'm, I'm about to hand it back oh, over. I thought you were that, my, my question's in. Yeah, now we're done. Right. Game's over. You all good? We're going to do the tabletop? No, we are. That's Let's do it. All right. All right, guys. Now you all have a lot of questions still. Um, we're going to sign off real quick. We're going to go do some other stuff around the house, some marine things. This was us in Gears of War, not that. Let me see, let me see. This from Pirates of the Caribbean 3. Oh, yeah. yeah like, like, <laughs> you get like, he got like his head blown off like, the first I love like, that. 10 seconds. I love that. All right. Oh, man. Guys, thank you so much for dropping by the stream. If you're new to the stream, please subscribe to my YouTube. Um, if you want to follow me on Instagram, you can follow me at Clayton Philpo. I also have a Twitter. If you want to send any fan mail, if you go to boot camp and want to send letters there, if you want to make donations or donate any games, you can go ahead and check out my P.O. box, which is in the video description below. Uh, again, please share the channel. Please share the stream. We'll see you all tomorrow around 8.30, 8.45 p.m. Eastern Time. Later.